Hi, Mark here from Everything E-Bikes. Let's say you're a senior citizen who would like some exercise, maybe lose some weight, or just get out and have some fun. E-biking is the answer. It's fun, it's exciting, it's doable for seniors, and it is really catching on today. So the big question is, what kind of e-bike should you buy? There are a lot of different answers, but first, let's pretend you're not looking to enter the Tour de France bike race today. Um, I think the best place to start is to take an ordinary bike and see what the next level is for the entry-level e-bike. You see, all that an e-bike is is a regular bike with a motor on the wheel or in the pedal hub and a throttle or controller. In its most basic form, that is all you need to enjoy rides on your street, in the park, or on bike paths. Now, when you decide you want to venture forth and go trail riding, racing with your new lady or boyfriend, or God forbid your actual spouse, then you can go upgrading from there. All e-bikes start with a size of motor, a type of battery, and a throttle or controller to turn the motor on and off as required. Here is a picture of my e-bike that I use for regular riding, the Bernelli Classico. It does even look like an e-bike. It has a 350 watt motor in the front wheel hub which I use to go over hills and extend my ride for a longer, much more enjoyable experience. From here I can look at maybe an Aventon Adventure or Rad Power e-bike for a bit more power, maybe a rack to carry things, a cell phone holder, an LCD display for telling me the mileage, power remaining in the battery, and some even have GPS and weather displays. Like regular bikes, you should always wear a helmet. Always have lights and reflectors. A horn is almost mandatory. So take a look and see what you think about looking and feeling better and having some fun doing it.